Fans of Limitless Wrestling, we're back here at Let's Wrestle Volume 10, Don't Lose Your Head, with first time ever tag team action. As the main state posse of Danger Kid and Aiden Agro collide with the natural Channing Thomas and the prize Alec Price. A new team here to Let's Wrestle and Limitless Wrestling and guys who have really, really improved throughout the year in Let's Wrestle competition. Channing Thomas actually making his Limitless Wrestling debut earlier this year at the 2019 Vacationland Cup. Alec Price following suit making his debut at Fresh Blood this past October. And we're gonna see what they can do against some Limitless Wrestling pillars. Some guys who have been here from the very beginning. And to be honest, probably one of the best tag teams in Limitless Wrestling history. The main state posse is Channing Thomas lights up Danger Kid with a big chop against the ropes. Danger Kid though, catching himself on the ropes, kicks out the knee of the natural Channing Thomas. And there he comes, big kick to the back of the head. And DK looking to fly cannonballs himself onto the back of Channing Thomas. Hot start for the mainstay posse and Alec Price, the loudmouth, not pleased. What a kick from the Pine Prince. And it's been a rough start for Alec Price and Channing Thomas in this contest as it looks like Aiden Agro is going to fly Tope Suicida through the middle rope. And this crowd is on fire right now at the American Legion Post 84, the home of Let's Wrestle. And now Danger Kid looking to take flight. And here he comes over the top rope. Taking out Alec Price, Channing Thomas, and a woman out of her seat. And he's gonna bring her all the way around this place. Maybe she's the replacement for Alexander Lee. Aiden Agro throwing Channing Thomas back into the ring. Maybe we're getting some order back in this tag team contest. Suplex center of the ring from Aiden Agro. Rolls over. Only two from referee Eric Greenleaf. And there's the color wheel, that cartwheel elbow drop. We've seen time and time again from the Pine Prince cover once again, only two. As Channing Thomas powers the shoulder up. And there's a tag to Danger Kid. Time for a little teamwork. That brother Senton absolutely crushing Channing Thomas cover. Two, only two once again. You can hear Alec Price screaming from the corner. He wants to get in this contest and quick. And he may get his opportunity. Channing Thomas with a jawbreaker. Rings the arm of Danger Kid, but unbeknownst to him, there was a tag to Aiden Agro as Danger Kid flies around. Big kick on Channing. Kick to the back of the head from Agro. And a clothesline from Danger Kid. What a combination from the Main State Posse. Only two. Eric Greenleaf getting no love in the heart of Orno Rock City. Channing Thomas gets to the ropes, tries to create some distance, but Aiden Agro not far behind, drapes his arm. Oh my goodness, sounds like a gunshot. And you can see the color starting to come to the chest of Channing Thomas, bright red. And they want more. I know I do. Oh my goodness. And Channing needs a way out of this contest and fast. A rough go for him to say the least thus far. Big whip and Alec Price 
Catches Channing Thomas against the ropes. Channing Thomas sending Agro to the apron. Caught Alec Price, but there's a wicked clothesline from Channing Thomas. And now Alec Price laying in the stops to Aiden Agro as the referee's back is turned. And this is the tag team cohesion I wasn't sure we'd see from Alec Price and Channing cover only two. And now Channing and Alec finally gonna be able to make that tag as the prize enters this contest. Fresh off one of the most vicious matches of his career, a last man standing match with CJ Cruz where he fell in defeat but nothing to shake his head at. There's a quick tag to Channing Thomas and a chop from Alec Price. Double whip to the Pine Prince. Channing drops down. Alec off the back of Channing Thomas. Lands the kick. Great tag team offense from these two and only two. From referee Eric Greenleaf and Channing. Unhappy. And now the Shannon chance reigning in. He's been battling this name confusion for months here in Let's Wrestle. No one can seem to get it right. Even the ring announcer, Ethan Scott, has had issues. And speaking of issues, Aiden Agro in a world of trouble right now after that delay suplex. One, two, only two. Channing letting the blood run to Aiden Agro's head before dropping him on his back. And there's a tag to Alec Price who enters this contest once again. Sends Aiden Agro off. Agro, those sunset flip shoulders are down of Alec Price. Only two. And Alec right back up with that surprise kick to the back of the skull of Aiden Agro. And that could be it. Only two. Aiden Agro powering that shoulder up just in a nick of time. And now the tables have turned. It's a Nagra who desperately needs to make a tag as he's dropped with a belly-to-back suplex from Alec Price. Eric Greenleaf down for the cover. Two, only two once again. And you can see Danger Kid on the corner trying to will his partner over to his corner as Alec Price sends Agro in, follows up with a back elbow. Oh, but he runs into a boot that time of Aiden Agro. A back elbow to Channing. Agro fighting for his life right now. Another back elbow to the natural. Oh, and Channing sweeps the foot out with Greenleaf's back turned, and Alec Price able to drop a knee on the back of the head. One, two, only two once again. The Pine Prince, the definition of resilient. As Alec Price continues to argue with Eric Greenleaf. Tag made to the natural Channing Thomas. Coming off a recent win against Scott Wilde in Let's Wrestle competition. Agro once again fighting for his life as he gets out of the way. And he's still the ring length away from Danger Kid. What is he gonna do here? Agro advancing to the top. There's Alec Bryce. Goodbye to you. And he cartwheels off the back of Channing Thomas to make the tag. And here comes DK. Big clothesline follows it up with another one. Kick to Alec Bryce. That twirling suplex from Danger Kid. And a low drop kick sends Channing Thomas back to the floor, catches the line of Alec Price. There's a kick. Maybe look at that Tiger Driver. Oh my God. Oh my God. Could be it for Alec Price. Only two. The prize getting the shoulder up just in a nick of time. There's the tag to Aiden Agro once again. Main State Posse looking for some tag team offense here as they hook up Alec Price. Alec though landing on his feet. 
ducking the double line from the mainstay posse. Aggro catches it, maybe looking for the last vacation. And that's exactly what they're doing. Last vacation, this could be it. No, but Channing Thomas with the awareness, shoving Danger Kid on top of the pile, breaks up the pin, pulls Alec to his corner, and Chan that move right there could have saved Channing Thomas and Alec Price in this contest. Heads up by Channing Thomas, able to make sure that tag was made. And I don't think the mainstay posse realized what's gone on as they elevate Alec Price. Knees to the back, they're looking for the death drop, but Channing Thomas shoves Danger Kid halfway across the ring. Oh no! Introduces Agro to that post hard. And now it's Channing and Alec looking for some tag team offense. The kick and they drop Danger Kid on the back of his neck. One, two, unbelievable. Danger Kid powering the shoulder up at two and three fourths. And Channing directing traffic. Trying to set up some more tag team offense, it looks like as they elevate Danger Kid to the top. Looks like Alec Price and Channing Thomas will not be that far behind. For a superplex here. As they have Danger Kid hooked up at Aiden Agro. Oh! Sends Alec Price hard to the floor. Looking for the death drop, knees to the back. There's the senton! The main state death drop and Channing is the legal man. One, two, and that's it. Valiant effort from Channing Thomas and Alec Price against one of the top teams in Limitless Wrestling history, but tonight was not their night. Tonight was the night of the Maine State Posse.